Hello guys, today I am going to discuss with you most important inbuilt visual of Power BI that is KPI. In this session, we will understand what is KPI, why we need KPI and what KPI does in Power BI. And also we will write the DAX formula to calculate the KPI percentage in Power BI. So let's start from KPI definition. KPI means Key Performance Indicator and it is used to track the performance of achievement sales as per assigned target periodically in form of percentage and values. Now I will show you how KPI works. Suppose I am interested to see the performance of achievement and target for year 2010. So for that I select year 2010 from year slicer and you can see here KPI visual showing some values in red color with negative percentage sign. So that means this year I not achieved my target and I lose my target with minus 87.5 percentage. Now I am going to select year 2012. So you can see here KPI showing values with green color and positive percentage sign. So that means this year I achieved my target with plus 20 percentage. Now I am going to select year 2016. So you can see here again it is showing values as in red color with negative percentage sign. So that means this year I have not achieved my target and I lose my target with minus 40 percentage. So this is the advantage of KPI visuals and you can track the performance of your achievement and target periodically. Same thing we will implement as in practical. So let's move to the practical file. So you can see here this is my practical page and here I am using sales data set and under that data set I have three columns. One is year, second is target and third one is achievement and this one is my year slice. Now I am going to drag KPI visuals in my report page. So for that I go to the visualization tab and you can see here this is KPI visuals. So double click to KPI visuals. Now move to the KPI visuals next to the year slicer and increase the size of KPI visuals. KPI visuals support three fields. One is indicator, second one is trend axis and third one is target goals. So in target goals we will drag our target column. In trend axis we will drag our year column because we want to see performance year wise and in indicator column we will drag our achievement column right so go to the field section and i am using sales data set now i am going to drag year column as in trend axis and achievement column as in indicator section and target column in target goal section and now i want to increase font size for better visibility so for that i go to the format bar and you can see here indicator means achievement if you want to increase the font size for your achievement value so you can set from here and now i want to increase font size for target so here goals mean target so i want to increase font size for target value so i make it 15 pixel and then also i want to increase font size for here so date means trend axis so here i am using year as a trend axis so for year i increase font size 15 pixel right and also i want to enable border for kpi visual so from here i select gray color so you can see here now my kpi card has been ready always remember one thing here if you are working with kpi visuals by default kpi will display latest target and achievement values so you can see here it is showing 160,000, goal is 140,000, year is 2020. What is this? This is my latest target and achievement data. By default, it will display latest data. So you can see here in data set for year 2020, target was 140,000 and achievement was 160,000. So you can see here in KPI it is showing 160,000. That is my achievement and goal means target and target is 1 lakh 40,000 and year is 2020 right it is showing 1 lakh 60,000 as in green color so that means I achieved target for year 2020 because target was 1 lakh 40,000 so that's why it is showing achievement as in green color and 2020 is year right so hope you clear about all three values we will discuss percentage part later right now i am going to select year 2010 so you can see here it is showing values as in red color and percentage as in negative so that means so for year 2010 i not achieved my target so you can see here here is 2010 target is 8 lakh and achievement is 1 lakh 
right so achievement is one lakh so that's why it is showing achievement as in red color because this year i not achieved my target and goal goal means target and target is 8 lakh right and year is 2010 now i am going to select year 2012 so you can see here for year 2012 it is showing values as in green color so that means for year 2012 i achieved my target because target was 1 lakh and achievement was 1 lakh 20 thousand right so that's why it is showing me achievement as in green color so be clear about all three values now i'm going to discuss with you percentage formula for kpi right so you can see here this is percentage formula for kpi achievement minus target divided by target multiply 100 right now i am going to open my calculator to check the percentage right so it is showing me plus 20 percentage for year 2012 so we will cross check this percentage with this formula right achievement minus target divided by target multiply 100 okay so i open calculator here so you can see here achievement is 1,20,000 so here I simply write 1,20,000 right minus target target was 1 lakh right divided by target so target is 1 lakh right multiply 100 so you can see here it is showing 20% right so see here plus 20 percent is right so hope you clear how kpi calculate the percentage so i am showing once again the formula for kpi percentage so that is achievement minus target divided by target multiply 100 right so to using same calculation i write the tax function for kpi percentage so you can see here formula for kpi percentage so what i did here firstly i store the sum of target in one variable then i store sum of achievement in another variable and then i minus total target from total achievement as per our formula so you can see here achievement minus target right so this is the difference of achievement minus target and then i divide difference of achievement minus target with total target so you can see here achievement minus target divided by target right divided by target here so and after that i change the data type for kpi measure and i select percentage right because i convert this measure as in percentage now i am going to drag this measure in my table visual so you can see here it is showing me percentage right so you can see here right now it is showing for year 2020 percentage is 14.29 percent so you can see here same percentage here if i select 2010 year so for 2010 year percentage is minus 87.50 percent so you can see here minus 87.50 if i select 2013 so for 2013 percentage is 30 percent so you can see percentage right so hope you clear how you will calculate kpi percentage and how kpi works in power bi thank you guys